Hi, I'm Rick Payway for Gone Jeepin'. And we're in a special Jeep today. This is a Jeep concept vehicle called the Magneto. Why is it called the Magneto? It's because it's full electric. This isn't a hybrid. This is no gas engine, even though the dash panel still says we're low on fuel. It's fully electric. And what they've done is duplicated the power output in horsepower and torque to the current Pentastar engine, the gas engine. So we're gonna have on this little short trip a, an idea of where that torque curve is. Because of course with the Pentastar, it kind of goes up eventually, flattens out. This one is straight up and straight flat, which is really cool if you're trying to go over rocks. And we're gonna do that right here. We're in four high and we're in first gear. Now, you, I said it's electric, right? But look down here. This is a stick shift, a manual transmission. I'm gonna give it a little bit. Oh, wow. It's quiet. Do you hear any exhaust note? No. Of course, it's just a two-door stock JL. So it's a little bit odd being able to shift. You shift, but you don't have to worry about giving it any fuel at all. Okay, see, I, I put it in fifth, yet it doesn't feel like you're going fast until you gas it. Oh, excuse me. Volt it? What's the proper turn? Electro it? Okay, I'm gonna go really slow here. I just wanna creepy crawl it. I'm barely, I'm barely on the throttle. Which, is it a throttle anymore? It's not a gas pedal. Yeah, it gets, it takes a little bit getting used to as far as what we're doing. This doesn't have one of those hill hold buttons and being that it's an electric motor and you're supposed to be going forward in this mode, it will actually roll back on you. See how we're going back? Very slow, mind you. So that's that's something to think about. But remember, this is a prototype. This, this is stuff that they're doing so they're figuring out exactly how to make it perfect. You can get old really quick, quickly in first gear. We're here with Jim Morrison, Vice President of OG. You're the man. This is so fun to be out here in Moab. Oh, absolutely. I love being with you out here. Yeah, this is this is living. This doesn't get any better than this. That's why every year, you know, East, it's called Easter Jeep Safari. Yeah. Everybody comes to do this. Oh, absolutely. And then this year, you know, I always say, oh, we're in a special Jeep this time. And you've heard that a lot of times. This one is even more special. Because if you look at the hood right behind Jim, it says Magneto. Tell me, why is it called a magneto? Well, it's the, the play on magneto is the uh, is the it's an all battery electric Jeep. Uh, you may know that we're launching a um, a plug-in hybrid called Four by E in Wrangler right now, and this is a concept that tests a full battery Jeep. And the magneto name is based on the magnets that drive the uh, propulsion. In, uh, in an electric motor. So right. that's how you fun. make an electricity. Exactly. So. Well, that's what I was trying to do on this test. I mean, I know that you put this uh, motor, because it's not an engine, it's a motor, electric motor, and you uh, have set it up to be the same torque and horsepower as your Panasar 3.6. Yes. So it was really easy to get an idea. However, it's also an automatic ish because ish, it's a yes. stick transmission okay. yes so it's manual transmission hooked up to an electric motor which is not what i'm used to right? yes so you can shift it to any gear so you can get whatever ratio you want it's a four to one transfer cage right yes it's a rubicon it's a ruby yeah yeah a two-door stick ruby so it is a unicorn to begin with and then we have the electric motor yes okay so here's the cool thing is you push in the clutch you shift you let out the clutch and you don't go anywhere and you don't stall it. So if you've never been able to drive a stick shift manual transmission 
now you can. Yes, you can be a lot of people drawn to that thought even. Oh, gosh, it's yeah. the easiest manual ever to drive. You can't oh, spell yeah. it. Oh, I, I was trying to. Yes. So the, the cool thing is because the torque is right there, right off the end, you start coming up on these ledges, you know, and they're good ledges. And of course it stopped like an automatic would, it didn't stall like a manual would. And I just give it a little bit of throttle, gas pedal, whatever we're going to be calling this, volt enhancer, I don't know. Feed it the beans. Feed it the beans. <laughs> yeah. Well, you know, one of the coolest things about this is when you climb under it and you can see how we package all the batteries and all of the uh, the, the, um, the motors. It's all, you know, it, all after the transmission, right? So everything um, in front of the transmission is all the, the, the cool electric stuff. Everything after the transmission is all stock. Right, so the suspension, the wheels, the tires, everything is stock. Yeah, so it's stock. Everything that everyone loves about Wrangler and modifying, mm -hmm. they can still do it. It's incredible. Right. Yeah. Right. And and the fact that it's electric, you still have an electric winch. Yes. Yeah. We had a little bit of fun with that. We were gonna we were trying to find a gas powered winch to put on the electric Jeep, <laughs> but we couldn't find one. So we uh, went with Old Faithful, uh, threw a uh, worn winch on it, and uh, you know, win and if. This thing get, gets you in trouble, we can electric winch itself. It's a Jeep, and like our uh, Wrangler 4xE, it's got to be a real Jeep first, or it can't have the name on it. So Absolutely. that's what we're uh, focused on with the capability with this concept. Yeah, that's really cool. So what else can you tell us? When's it going to be available? You know what? I could tell you, but <laughs> I have to kill you. But that's the, that would take all the fun out of it. But the nice thing about our concepts is, you know, a lot of times that stuff does make it into production. And uh, you, oh, know, gosh, you yeah. saw it with our 392. It made it yeah. into production. How many it's, years have I been asking oh, for that? Oh, <laughs> exactly. And the pickup trucks. Yep. And diesels. Yep. You know, we have a three liter eco diesel. We've got Gladiator in the marketplace now. So the nicest thing about this is going to be gauging what our customers say about it. Mm -hmm. And if they wanted to bring us to production, we like to listen to our customers. So, so this is, whoa, talking about an unveiling. This is cool. Wow. That is impressive. All right. I mean, there's a lot of stuff in here I recognize, like the wiper bottle fluid. <laughs> but that's about where, where it ends. Oh, you got brake, brake fluid. fluid over there. Yeah, yeah you got power steering. Power steering. That's pretty cool. Well, that's intact. Here's your brakes and everything else. But this is absolutely incredible. How many volts is this? 800 volts. 800 eight, volts. Two, 400 packs in series. Wow, that is too cool. You know how much welding I could do with that? You could be welding for a <laughs> long time. Yeah. You could weld up axle tubes. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I can't wait to see where the where this is going to go in the future. This is, I mean, I mean, this is your first engineering step. So, I mean, there's there's things in there I don't even know what they are. But it says, "Don't touch." You're touching it. Yet I'm touching it. <laughs> does, does it hurt? Good stuff. Let's go find some sand. Yeah. <laughs> Closing thoughts on the incredible electric vehicle from Jeep. This is a lot of fun. What's also cool is I'm shifting because I can, and yeah, it can seem sluggish at start, but remember, you have to get up in that flat torque curve, and then you can just zip along. But even at that, it's it's an incredible vehicle. And am I going to miss driving a petrol engine? Of course. They're not going away. This is just another step in the evolution of Jeep, and that's really what's kind of fun to see. So that's it for today. I don't think you're going to be finding these in your local dealership anytime soon, but we brought it to you here first. That's our ride drive. Thanks again. Make sure you like, subscribe, and share on gunjeepin.com. <laughs>